Alright guys, Eric and I are at the Goodwill. We just dropped Amelia off at the groomer, so we figured we would stop in here. It snowed today, so we're not going to have time to go to like the antique store or anything like that. Uh, I never since, cleaned my truck out either. Since we're waiting on, yeah, from auctions, <laughs> Eric has a mess. But anyway, we're going to take a peek around here and see if we can find anything, so let's head on in found this Radiohead Creep Messenger Bag. This they want $7.99 for, but I did find this one and sold uh, for $49.99. That was back in 2016, so I am hoping it is extremely rare and maybe get more than 50 for it. So it's a pretty good, pretty cool find right there. So that's exciting. Um, as far as the rest of the purses, I didn't really find anything else. I will say, I did see, I did see this coach bag down here. Um, this here they have $7.99 on, but it's got some issues. It's kind of dirty. So I'm going to pass on that, but that's a good price and it is authentic. Oh my gosh, there's just so many cords. Are any of them signs? Er, uh, no. I don't see any signatures on that. These ones are cute. They look like little Kokashi dolls. Doesn't appear that any of them have signatures though, which is kind of weird. Because, you know, someone put a lot of work into painting these. You would think that they'd put their their signature on them, but I guess not. Look, there's even duck down here a turtle those are so cute so here i'm just spotting a sanrio kurobi water tumbler i did end up picking that up for a dollar 99 it was selling pretty consistently and this here they call a aztec burial mask it's pretty cool made of all sorts of stones there were abalone stones um i did take a minute to look that up and ended up picking it up this here is an by an artist a local artist named bobby becker that was a really cool piece and i grabbed that as well okay i think i might get these two these definitely have that y2k type vibe um but also people like using these types of lights like on patios rvs that type of thing so i think i'm gonna pick those up for 3.99 um i put that mask in here they call these burial masks aztec burial masks it's made of these really pretty shells so i'm gonna get that and i did pick up this karopi uh, milk carton little juice thing and i think eric's getting this little glass fish so i know that was pretty it's missing a lot of stones what are these canisters expressions expressions here i'll just show it expressions china okie doke so there's so many gourds it's insane they're so cute people put so much work into that they didn't even sign it oh my gosh i do like that though it's a whole set. I'm gonna get those. Those are really cute. I didn't see those. I did not see those. Okay, let's go down another aisle. <laughs> All right, there is going to be a little bit of voiceover in this video because at some points, you know, the music gets kind of loud and YouTube does not like that one little bit. <laughs> so I do apologize that there is some voiceover. I personally think it's more fun as I'm talking in the moment when I am discovering things, but it just doesn't always work out that way. <laughs> um, so here I'm just looking around. I think at some point up here, I do spot this really kind of unique, um, metal zodiac i love picking up anything zodiac astrology it was the aries ram kind of like a wind chime just like wall hanging piece i thought it was pretty unique and like i said i love picking up that kind of stuff that has anything to do with um you know zodiac signs and that so i did end up putting that in my cart and let's see where i'm off to next i think this 
this also caught my eye this was like a jewelry holder organizer with the owl um surprisingly the shelves were pretty pretty packed at goodwill this day um and like i had said too i believe in the video it had snowed so i don't know if that had any kind of help uh, that it was missing the little thing that hangs down that you would put your tart wax into i'm not even quite sure what the heck that thing was but it was pretty funny looking um and i'm just trying to see if i can catch anything with my eyes ahead of time while i'm doing my voiceovers if i saw anything interesting not necessarily that was just a little cat picture frame it was cute but nothing was really catching my eye um what's on here it says julie I wish it didn't have stuff on it, <laughs> like writing. That would have been more interesting. Pucker up, buttercup. What is it you can find this? this? Somebody painted a rock. Yeah, I can look. Look at this, this is cute. I looked at that. I was like, it's a party. Probably use that to yeah. display something. I don't know. What do you want me to look up? You want to see if you can find those? Wow, check those out. Target, but they look older. Yeah, they? I'll look those up. I, I was having trouble finding anything. I had to do a double take with this. I have never found a glassy baby before. I, it, this was not, <laughs> I don't even know if they're still a thing. I know they were for quite a while. Um, I feel like these, there would have been more of them. Like they would have stacked up and I only just saw the one, but I did like the, um, design on it. And this face just kind of caught my eye, but it wasn't really anything too, too great. Um, I'm actually finding some stuff today. Just surprising. <laughs> uh, Amelia is at the groomers right now. So we just decided to come in and take a look around while we wait for her to finish up at the groomers. So we wanted to go to the antique store today, but um, the timing isn't right. Uh, it snowed, so everyone's kind of on a delay and she'll probably be finished at the groomer before they open. So we'll just have to do that another day, which is fine doesn't always work out and that's okay so let's go look at some of the Easter stuff well there's actually some Valentine's Day stuff over here too so we'll take a look at that see if anything pops out at us not sure if it will so what it, today is tomorrow's Valentine's Day so, okay, here's the Easter stuff. Let's see if there's anything Eastery here that we want. Um, let's see. Nothing's really popping out at me. What is inside of this? That's weird. It must do something. I'm not entirely sure what, but. little painted egg it always weirds me out when like stuff doesn't have like actual eyeballs it just looks extra creepy these are cute more gourds they do want $9.99 a piece on those oh look at these ones oh my I do oh and they have feet too oh those are so cute they want $14.99 a piece on those. I feel like I don't really know how much more I could ask for those, but they're so cute. Oh my goodness. That is, that's something. I really do like those so much. I wish they weren't so pricey. $14.99 a piece. Ah. I feel like that's just too much, but I really do like them. Maybe I'll think about it. This is really precious. It's like a ceramic. I do like that. That's really sweet looking. 
the bear and the turtles and the bunnies. What did they have on that? $4.99. That is really cute. I was just really so going crazy about those <laughs> those Easter bunny gourds. I did get not the ones with the feet, but the other ones that kind of had the little prickly texture to them. I did pick those up. They are in my booth. Here's another rabbit. Oh my. $6.99 for that one. Ugh. Just feel like the prices are too, too high for, for those. All right, at this point, I think I was kind of having to go a little faster because I knew Amelia <laughs> was going to be done at the groomer. So we didn't have a whole lot of time to look around. So I was trying to be as quick as possible, but still, you know, trying to look at things, make sure I wasn't missing anything. But you just never know. Something can be like right in front of your face. And then when you go to edit the video. This happens all the time when I'm out at like yard sales and editing my videos. I'll just completely walk past something that was right in front of my face, literally right in front of my face. So it happens. You also come across a lot of broken stuff at Goodwill. So you need to really make sure that ornament was really cute, but I did not pick that up. And then as far as the rest of this shelf, there was another gourd. Gourds literally everywhere in the store that day. <laughs> I've sold one of these before. What is this one of? Oh, it's a dentist. I'm gonna look this up real quick. Eric spotted these red stemmed wine glasses. We're pretty sure these are made by Luminarch. Uh, looks like they have two for $1.99. They are crystal. Um, so I think we're going to take take all of these. All right, I'm gonna take this night cream for sure. It's still sealed. Uh, they have $4.99 on it, but it looks like it's a pretty easy 40 something. So you do. Uh, so I'm definitely gonna get that, but I haven't looked up the ornament yet. That was the same. Yeah, I already said hi to her. Uh, oh wait, are you? I, I'm gonna. I'm just gonna buy it because. What is that attitude adjuster? I'm, I'm buying it. Okay, go yeah. ahead. Trail boss, tenderfoot, <laughs> city slicker. <laughs> you can do what hey, you want. I'm, I'm just gonna get it. Are you gonna get it for somebody? No. Oh, I thought maybe you share or something. I found one similar selling for like thirteen to fifteen dollars. Not this exact graphic. Okay. Um, I think I'm just gonna take this. It's only a dollar ninety nine. I would say maybe I could sell it for around twelve. So we'll just get it. It's pretty specific. I mean, it's got to go to a dentist. So, <laughs> but are we done in the cups? Was there any other? Gonna have to wrap it up here. What's this say? Full liter. Yeah. Let me go down the aisle that I was on my way of going down. Okay, and then I'll try to move it along a little bit quicker. <laughs> okay, let's go find what aisle we were in. Um, I feel like I didn't go down. Was it this aisle? I feel like this aisle I didn't go down. So. It's the final countdown. No, seriously, um, we had gotten the call that, uh, or the text, I should say, that Amelia was done. So <laughs> I was completely scurrying <laughs> at this point and we had to call it a day. Dog's gonna be done here soon. Do you want another one? Another one of what? A dog? Sure. Yeah. Yeah. Hold on, I'm still looking. Oh yeah, I did just sell my little primitive rabbit head in the booth the other day. I think I only had five dollars on it though. So, no, yeah. yeah. Had six on it. Oh, I had six on it. But with like the discount, yeah, it would have been like five. It's one of those things like I'd rather just pick up. Um, I should have bought the light. <laughs> yeah, right. I'd probably just pick up at like a yard sale or something. 